Hello, friends. Our topic for today is about Ebola virus. Ebola virus was first discovered in 1976 near the Ebola River in what is now the Democratic Republic of Congo. Since then, the virus has been infected people from time to time, leading to outbreak in the several African countries. The Ebola virus is transmitted among the human through close indirect physical contact with infected bodily fluids, the most infectious being blood, feces, and vomit. The Ebola virus has also been detected in the breast milk, urine, and semen. The scientists do not know where Ebola virus came from. However, based on the nature of similar viruses, they believe the virus in animals burns with bats or non-human primates or chimpanzees, apes, monkey, etc. being the most likely source. Ebola virus, a class A bioterrorism agent known cause a highly lethal hemorrhagic fever. The mortality rate can be a highly a high as a 90% because the Ebola virus is so hazardous it is classified as a biosafety level 4 agent the level assigned to the most dangerous agent known there is no cure for Ebola thoughts researchers are working on it only one drugs treatment has been approved for treating Ebola El maize is a mixture of three monoclonal antibodies Antoltibimab, Matibimab, and Odistibimab, AVGN Other treatments include an experimental serum that destroys infected cells The U.S. Food and Drugs Administration, FDA, approved the Ebola vaccine RBCV Sivu called Ervivo on December 19, 2019. This is the first FDA approved vaccine for Ebola. Ebola virus outbreak species and size since 1976. Cyri Ebola virus is the most fatal Ebola virus. It was associated with the 2014-2016 outbreak in West Africa. The largest Ebola outbreak to date with more than 26,600 cases as well as the current ongoing outbreak in the Democratic Republic of Congo. How did the American stop Ebola? So across the Atlantic Ocean, President Barack Obama ordered the most robust response to a violent outbreak in the American history. He dispatched almost 3,000 army soldiers to Liberia to build the treatment facilities and necessary to stop the spread of Ebola. The 101 ST Airborne Division headed to heart of the head zones October 24, 2019. Although Ebola is a severe after the fatal disease, getting a medical care early can make a significant difference. Today, about one, of one out of three Ebola patients survive. Many of them are now using their experience to help fight the disease in their country so guys thank you so much for uh, watching if you like this video please uh, leave like share and subscribe thank you so much